EVS chapter 11 animals and their uses there are many animals in our environment yes or no students yes they are of different shapes size and colors agreeing yes they live in different kinds of homes yes we have learned shelter for animals yes or no in the previous video they live in different kinds of homes and eat different types of food yes animals can be classified into different groups now which are those groups domestic animals wild animals and pet animals yes or no so what are the classification of animals domestic animals wild animals and pet animals so let us see each one one by one along with pictures first we are going to see domestic animals so ready now what are domestic animals domestic animals are those animals who help us in our everyday life domestic animals are harmless they can be tamed for our use yes or no students yes name the picture dog so what a dog does a dog guards the house and the farm yes or no name the picture cat so what is the use of a cat a cat kills all the rats around the house or the farm name the picture camel so what is the use of a camel a camel is known as the ship of the desert as it help us by carrying out belongings and transportation to different places yes or no camel is used for transportation sometimes we also get on his back yes or no that is why camel is known as the ship of the desert name the picture donkey what is the use of a donkey a donkey is known as the beast of burden and helps us by carrying heavy loads on its back from one place to another yes or no students donkey is always known for carrying heavy loads yes or no yes name the picture sheep so what is the use of a sheep sheep gives us wool yes wool is used to make woolen clothes yes and woolen clothes keeps us warm in which season yes winter season yes or no students agreeing yes so sheep gives us wool name the picture cow buffalo so cow and buffalo they give us milk yes or no name the picture bullock or you can say bullock cart bullocks help in plowing the field yes bullocks are used for farming yes or no bullocks are also used as bullock carts to carry medium size loads of vegetables or fruits you, you may have seen sugarcane bullock cart yes or no sugarcane carrying bullock cart watermelon carrying bullock cart name the picture horse or horse cart in some countries even horses are used for plowing the field horses are used for farming other than plowing or other than farming a horse can take us from one place to another that is why i have shown you the image of horse cart in hindi we say tanga in english and the spelling is t o n g a tonga t o n g a tonga name the picture hen and duck so hens and ducks lays eggs which is sold in the market yes or no name the picture parrot mina so parrots and minas are kept as pets at home in cage name the picture fish fish is good for health yes 
फिश कंटेन्स लॉट ऑफ प्रोटीन्स एंड अदर एसेंशियल ऑइल विच आर गुड फॉर अवर हेल्थ यस और नो स्टूडेंट्स नेम द पिक्चर हनी बी सो बीस गिव अस हनी विच इज वेरी स्वीट इन टेस्ट एंड गुड फॉर हेल्थ येस नेम द पिक्चर सिल्क वॉम दिस इज नॉट ए कैटर पिलर इट इज ए सिल्क वॉम सिल्क वॉम एंड कैटर पिलर कम्स इन वन फैमिली सिल्क वॉम्स गिव अस सिल्क सिल्क इज ए फैब्रिक इट इज ए क्लोथ वी मेक क्लोथ्स आउट ऑफ सिल्क फॉर एग्जाम्पल सिल्क सारी योर मदर हैज अ सिल्क सारी येस सो सिल्क वॉम गिवस अस सिल्क Name the picture earthworm. Many students read it as snake. Students, we are discussing about domestic animal. So this image is not a snake. It is a earthworm. Look its body. It has lines on its body. So earthworm is very helpful for the farmers. Earthworm helps the farmer by keeping the soil loose and soft. Even earthworm is useful. We hate earthworms when it enters our house. Yes. so students since these animals help us in various activities we must take good care of them now how are you going to take care of them c we must feed animals at proper time and provide them with healthy food and clean drinking water next one the place in which they are kept should be cleaned regularly and should also have good ventilation ventilation means windows and doors next one in case of any injury or sickness animals must be treated immediately you should take those animals to the veterinary hospital they should be given proper medicines or injections to protect them from disease they should be allowed to move about freely in the fresh air animals must be given a bath regularly so students chapter is got over i hope you enjoyed watching many pictures and you have understood the chapter as well in this chapter you can do an activity in your scrap book stick any five pictures of domestic animals yes birds and insects thank you